The Jerry Doyle Show. The airlines are catering to the wealthy, the one percenters. New York to Hong Kong on Cathay Pacific. You can fly it in coach for sixteen hundred. You can up to business class for seventy six hundred. If you want to sit in first class, nineteen thousand dollars. You say, how many people have nineteen grand to fly from New York to Hong Kong on Cathay Pacific? Apparently a lot because 70% of airline revenue comes from 20% of their passengers and those 20% of the passengers are the rich and they're changing all the frequent flyer programs. Gets back to the basics of supply and demand. I don't understand why they don't understand in government or they don't explain it better. But if demand is there for products and services, that means we have money to spend. If we had more money to spend, there'd be more demand for products and services. And when there's more demand for products and services, what does that breed? Competition. And what does competition do? Drives prices down. And when prices go down, we get more bang for our buck. Do you see how this all works out? Cut the taxes, put money in our pockets instead of the government taking it out of our pockets. And then what happens? There's wage pressure. Pressure on the wages makes the average hourly wage go up. Then what happens? The 40-hour work week gets filled. And when the work week gets filled, then what happens? You need more people to do the work. What happens? Jobs are created. Guess what happens? The economy grows. Then you have more people paying taxes. Do they not understand? Econ- I skipped Econ 1 and 1 and 102 in college because I was surfing with the Hawaiian Tropic Girls. I just happen to know the right answers. <laughs> 